She doesn't have a tiara. She doesn't even carry a scepter. But Evelyn Geyser is known by many here as the queen of Foster Elementary. To others, she's Miss Evelyn. And a wave, a smile, a hug are always part of her daily routine. Evelyn has been a part of the Foster family since 1967. I enjoy coming here. I look forward to coming to school. I really do. That's 51 years. For most of that time, she was a second grade paraprofessional. And I don't know what PAR means. It, all I know is that they come and be with the teachers and with the kids. I did that from 1967 to uh, 2000. It was back in 2000 that Evelyn took a year-long break from education to care for her ailing mother. And then when she passed, the principal asked me if I would come back. Since then, Evelyn stayed close to her workroom, where she's one of the few people at Foster that still knows how to keep the laminator running. She's like a magical little elf or something. You leave something on, on her desk at night, you say you need however many copies by this time the next day or whenever, and then poof, they're in your box, even before you ask for them. My husband passed away five years ago. So yeah, what else would I do but be by myself? Evelyn has seen a lot of changes during her half century of service to foster. Computers, very much so. The kids know a lot more about the computers than I do. The kids are a lot smarter than when I started. But it's when she thinks of all those kids that have passed through Foster's doors that it really hits her. It, it amazes me because now I'm sure some of them are mothers, fathers, maybe even grandmas. Her heart is here. She does this not, not for the money. She does this because she loves giving back and because she loves being able to be a part of the foster community and we're so grateful to have her. And just how long will the reign of Foster's Queen last? I'm going to stay here until they fire me or I drop over dead. Well, that's a commitment. No, that's enjoyment.